Why are people getting so riled up about Lori Harvey's um, life? Guys, she's young, she's confident, she's smart, she's articulate, and she knows what she wants. She don't allow people to influence her decisions. Get over it. People are out here having fit over the girl's decision. You don't even know who she dating. And whether or not, that's her business. Okay? Get a life. Lori lives how she wants to live. She seems to be very confident and smart and put herself first. You can't be mad with a sister for putting herself first. Listen up. We have the power. And we hold the power to our happiness. If we value ourselves, we will be happier. In her interview, she said she will not compromise her values and our standard. Many times, we women, that's what we do. We just break, let these guys break us. Lori, I love the way she moves in silence. She doesn't allow people's opinion to affect her. Now is the age she's experiencing and experimenting as she dates. Check out this little clip where she did an interview with Tiana Taylor. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel, guys. Bless. Like you, I grew up with brothers. Mm -hmm. So yeah. I was like, all right, I know how this is going down. <laughs> and um, it's like a I'm going to move oh, you accordingly. Beat to the punch. Yeah, I'm just going to move yeah. accordingly. Yeah. And also, like, I almost got married very young. Mm -hmm. And so I think after that, it made me be like, okay, I felt like I hadn't really experienced anything. I didn't really know myself. I didn't really know what I liked, what I didn't like. I just feel like I hadn't really experienced life. So mm -hmm. I think at that point, then I was like, okay, I'm about to, like I said, just date on my terms. And like, however I want to move, whatever I want to do, I'm going to do it. And if it's no longer serving me, I'm going to move on. I mean, that's Especially that's... coming from you. What made you say this? What, what are you feeling in this time? I just feel like I'm growing. I mm -hmm. feel like I'm growing as a woman, as an individual. So I just feel like, you know, this time is about me. Self-love, self-growth. Yeah just being patient with myself in every stage as I'm growing. But I feel like even saying like, I'm single and saying this is a single woman on the cover, you've been in, like I said, so many relationships that we've heard about. Mm -hmm. And you're like, yes, I've been attached to these things. It's about someone or someone else. How does it feel to finally be able to do a cover like this and be like, it ain't about them, mm -hmm. it's about me. And what, what does that mean to you? It feels very empowering. Yeah. Like I said, like I feel like this year especially, like I'm really stepping into my own, coming yeah. to my own as a woman. I feel like I'm officially kind of getting grown now. Okay. I'm really learning myself. Yeah. You know, I'm growing my brand, growing my business. Yeah. So I'm just focusing on me now. I feel like I've, you know, focused on so many other things for years just as I've been growing. You know, I was young. You had to yeah. figure yourself out. Um, just figuring out how to navigate life. So I know, feel like we saw time. a lot of you, but it was even like even now hearing you do interviews and being like, I want to come out here, I want to talk, I want people to hear what I have to say, what I think. I remember some of your first interviews, one of the first was on The Real. And a lot of the, the comments were like,